Good Omens, by Terry Pratchett and Neil Gaiman is a comedic novel that tells the story of the impending apocalypse and the unlikely duo of an angel and a demon who work together to prevent it. The book was first published in 1990 and has since gained a cult following, leading to a television adaptation in 2019. The novel begins with the birth of the Antichrist, who is switched at birth with another child, leading to confusion about who the real Antichrist is. As a Raphael, an angel who has been on earth since the beginning of time, and Crowley, a demon who was there at the fall of man, are tasked with ensuring that the Antichrist fulfills his destiny and brings about the end of the world. However, as they have both grown fond of humanity and their life on earth, they decide to work together to sabotage the apocalypse. As the day of the apocalypse draws near, Azaraphael and Crowley try to locate the Antichrist and prevent him from fulfilling his destiny. Along the way, they encounter a colorful cast of characters, including a group of witches, a group of bikers, and a book-loving witchfinder named Newton Pulsifer. They also have to contend with the four horsemen of the apocalypse, who are gathering in preparation for the end of the world. Despite the gravity of the situation, the book is full of humor and satire, with Pratchett and Gaiman skewering everything from organized religion to bureaucracy. The book also explores themes of free will, friendship, and the nature of good and evil. One of the standout characters in the book is Crowley, who is initially presented as a typical demonic figure, but is later revealed to have a soft spot for humanity. His relationship with Azaraphael is a highlight of the book, as they are two characters who are supposed to be mortal enemies, but have developed a friendship over the centuries. Another notable aspect of the book is the use of footnotes, which are often humorous asides that provide additional information about the story or the world building. The footnotes are also used to comment on the action and add another layer of humor to the story. In the end, Azaraphael and Crowley are able to prevent the apocalypse, but not before causing chaos and confusion along the way. The book ends with the two of them meeting at a sushi restaurant to celebrate their victory and reflect on their friendship. Overall, Good Omens is a hilarious and thought-provoking book that explores big themes while never taking itself too seriously. The dynamic between Azaraphael and Crowley is a highlight, as is the book's irreverent humor and satirical take on religion and society. It's no wonder that the book has become a beloved classic and continues to attract new fans decades after its initial publication.